Elon, if x to the power 0 is 1, then what about 0 to the power 0 tell me? Well, that's actually one of the most controversial questions in mathematics. To figure it out, we need to look at pattern. Pay close attention. If x equals 1, what's x to the power x? 1, that's easy. Exactly. Now let's take, take it step by step. From 1 heading towards 0, 0 0.9 to the power 0 0.9 is 0 0.91. 0 0.8 to the power 0 0.8 is 0 0.83. Now tell me what 0 0.7 to the power 0 0.7. Let me try. 0 0.7 to the power 0 0.7 is about 0 0.78. 0 0.6 to the power 0 0.6 is 0 0.73. 0 0.5 to the power 0 0.5 is 0 0.707. 0 0.4 to the power 0 0.4 is 0 0.693. Oh, I see it, Elon. It's heading towards 0. Hold on, Trump. The magic happens now. Try it with 0 0.3. Well, that gives 0 0.696. And wait a second. Now the value is going up. 0 0.2 is 0 0.72, 0 0.1 gives 0 0.79. Right. Oh, so now it's heading towards 1. Not so fast. Go even smaller. Try 0 0.01. That gives about 0 0.95. 0 0.001 gets a 0 0.99. Aha, I get it now. 0 to the power 0 is 1. Not quite. Here's the nuance. As x approaches 0, x to the power x approaches 1. So, in computer programming, we define 0 to the power 0 as 1, because it makes calculations easier. But, in pure arithmetic, it's actually undefined.